Let's simplify the fraction 28 40 ninths. Here's how we can do that. We're looking for another fraction that's equal to 28 divided by 49. It's just that we'll have simplified or reduced it down to lowest terms. So we need to find a common factor, the greatest common factor, that goes into both 28 and 49 evenly. So let's write the factors for 28 and 49. So these are the factors for 28 and then for 49. We're looking for the greatest common factor and it looks like seven. That's our greatest common factor. We divide 28 by seven, 49 by seven, and we'll simplify the fraction 28 49 Let's move these over here. So 28 divided by seven, that's four. And then seven divided by seven is seven. So we've simplified 28 49 down to four sevenths, and we can't reduce this any further. These are equivalent fractions, 28 divided by 49 or four divided by seven. They give you the same decimal value. It's just that we've simplified or reduced 28 49 down to lowest terms. This is Dr. B and thanks for watching.